What's up? What's good, guys? How y'all doing? Welcome to the Stud Poppy Podcast slash Stud Poppy Family. And today we about to get into this video of Jada Youngin with Shot in Louisiana. Shout out to uh, DJ Ghost for this video. Let's see what he got to say about this. So look, bro. Uh, Jada Youngin, bro, got shot today. You know what I'm saying? I just seen the news on the internet, and when they said he got shot, I'm already knowing. As soon as I get on YouTube, which I already did, oh. you got everybody talking about, oh, he got killed, he got whooped, whooped, whooped for the clickbait. Wow. All I know right now, bro, J.D. Youngin was with his pops. Okay. Uh, and this is one thing I be saying about just life. It ain't even got to come to rappers. One thing, like, you just never know when it's going to be your dad. It can be a regular boring day. It can right. be a regular boring ass day. A turned up day. You can mm. die at somebody else's funeral. You just never know, bro. But anyway, he was with his pops. I don't know if they got killed. I mean, he got shot in the car. Right. In the house. I just know it was up in Louisiana. You know what I'm saying? Wow. They say in his hometown, so I know both from Louisiana type of shit. Um, That's crazy. That's wild. That's absolutely crazy. For real. Like, you never know when it's your day. For real. Like, and that's honest. He get transported to the hospital. Gunshot victim. I don't know about his pops. Teddy Young and the most popping up in the situation. So, of course, right. they gonna try to, like, not try to, but whatever happened to his pops, Teddy Young go up shout out that because he's the rapper. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And then when they take both to the hospital, you hear the nigga get popped. If I hear it all the way on the West Coast, of course his family heard it. You know what yeah. I'm saying? They go to the hospital to go see, to, to make sure you're all right. You just right. got shot. Right, right. And when they get to the hospital, bro, some niggas pull up and shoot up the hospital. Oh, and no. I guess they were shooting at his family, his family shooting back or something. Whoa. That's crazy. The last month and a half, two months, all reports been a rapper dying, rapper getting killed, rapper dying, rapper getting killed. And every time it happened, you know, these other rappers look at the situation like, shh, I gotta be tight. Boy, tight as can be. You feel me? Tight as can be. No cap. And I make sure I'm not quiet. And everybody's human, with that being said. If you see a rapper, if another rapper see a rapper get smoked today, he got it. Oh yeah, I'm gonna move like militant, like the president. Woo, woo, woo. Mm -hmm. He only had that mindset for like a week or two, maybe three. Then he gonna get back comfortable. That's how it is with life. Period. Jaddy Youngin, hope you pull through it. Yeah. As this progress, y'all already know I'm gonna come back with the videos. Y'all get on my hood and pop y'all. We're talking about it over here. I really don't know all right because these rappers are losing. When I say losing, I mean losing their life. No. It's a saying out there that's real. And you ain't got to live by it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You ain't got to believe it. But none of that type of shit. But it goes, live by the hand, by the hand. What I mean by you ain't gotta live by it. You probably, you a gangster, all right, cool. Right. You should thug, you that nigga in your city, all right, cool. Mm -hmm. Anybody fresh, you, you feel disrespected. Somebody owe you something, you gonna handle that, you know what I'm saying? But you're not out looking for it. Yeah. You got people that's thirsty that's out looking for smoke. I wanna rob him, I wanna smoke him, I wanna move through the Like, nah. But at the same time, if you are thirsty, you're not looking for the smoke. But you do keep your little burner on you or whatever the case. And I'm speaking on Jay the Young. I remember this Instagram clip to where he was on Instagram with a, with a drum up in his, uh, on his pistol types. Anyway, the quote I'm saying is live by the gun, die by the gun. If you got it on you, bro. Problems will come your way. You gotta be ready for it. If you got it on you, 
problems will come your way. And I tell y'all this all the time, and I'm saying it again. If you feel like you gotta have a gun to be there, then you do not need to be there. Period. You know, do something else. I can show you. Chill with your girl, get on PlayStation. You know what I'm saying? Mm hmm. That's all I got for y'all till more of the story come out. Get mm. it, bro. Period. That's on so period. But, um, so what y'all think? You know what I'm saying? I want to know y'all thoughts and y'all, you know, feelings in the comment section down below. You know what I'm saying? Um, this video will only stay up for about a day. And then it's going to be on the Patreon. Well, it's already going to be on the Patreon, but it will only be on the Patreon. So you have to go over there and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? And the link will be in the description so y'all can check us out over on Patreon. All right. Until next time, I'm Stella Poppy with the Stella Poppy family, and I got to go.